Hey you guys, me I'm Charles Samson back here again for my first impressions of episode 1 of The Dark Crystal Age of Resistance. Now there's not any spoilers here, but again, this is just first impressions. Um wow. Um this series looks fantastic. Um I know there's people out there uh, that that grew up with the original and again, I I saw when I was little. Um I know you guys, some of you are complaining that like they are using CG. Trust me, get get that that little negative out of there because the CG is just amazing. Like even with like some of the creatures being CG, um, they animated to where like it feels like they're being puppeteered by puppeteers. <laughs> I mean, puppeted by puppeteers. Um, but it's just stunning. Like I'm mean, quite honest with you. Um, the intro it goes into the the lore. Of the Gelfling, like they mentioned, like there's like um like three or four or five again. I just got done watching it. Of uh, different kinds of um, Gelfling, and like it's all coming at you like crazy. But I'm so distracted by the visuals that like I had to rewind it just a couple times just to get every little thing. Um, so suffice it to say, you're gonna be having a lot of eye candy with this series. Now, again, I don't really want to go in depth to you know in depth uh, with this one. At least this, even this, just one episode, just because there's so much to cover. And again, I am I just started watching episode one. I have not continued the series. Um, but you're probably having one question in your head: Do I need to watch the original film to to get this? I actually kind of recommend you watch the series first, just because like again, it's new. It, again, it adds so much to more of the lore. Um, and I know what some of you out there is like, well, like the lore is already set there because there's a comic that takes place after the film. I haven't read it, so I'm sorry. Just keep that in mind. But yeah, I definitely recommend you do watch the series before the film just because um, the film itself will probably spoil what's going to happen in the series. Um, just putting it out there. Yeah, just from this one episode, uh, it is not holding back. Um, it is pretty creepy and pretty tense. Um, and some scary parts too. Do not show this to your five-year-old. Um, just because it has puppets does not mean uh, it's for kids. Okay, it's not. It's not your Sesame Street. Now, it doesn't mean it doesn't mean that it's gory or anything. No, it's not. But it is creepy. Uh, the voice acting is fantastic. Um, like again, I can't go over all the names right now. I just finished the, the first episode, but everyone is just great. Uh, Netflix, you've done a good job. Okay, just from this one episode I've seen. For, for the fans out there that have been waiting for a sequel. To the dark crystal this is it like so far just from this one episode i can say this is it now can it go pretty bad later in the season it could be but as of right now i am quite impressed with the dark crystal of age of resistance anyways guys what did you guys think of dark crystal age of resistance have you already binged it already or have you just seen the first episode let me know your thoughts below and i'll catch you guys next time